Almost 50% of Georgians have now had at least the first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine and soon medical experts may recommend a booster shot. Last week, we reported immunocompromised people could get a third shot. And new tonight, Hope Ford explains the difference between a booster and a third dose and why one woman says she's reassured after getting hers. In these COVID days, Zoom calls are standard, and so are the occasional Wi-Fi issues. For I think it broke up there. While video calls may not always be flawless, what's clear for Cindy Kohler is her reason to get a third COVID shot. Because I have MS, numerous uh, breathing problems all associated with the MS. Third COVID shots were approved for people with weak immune systems and booster shots may come soon for everyone else. And here we'll take a quick moment to explain the difference. When a third shot of the COVID vaccine is given to a person with a weakened immune system, it's just called an additional shot. But when that extra shot's given to a person with a healthy immune system, then it's called a booster shot. The idea is a third shot helps people with weakened immune systems catch up to the level of protection as people with healthy immune systems. While a booster would give folks with healthy immune systems longer lasting protection. Semantics aside, Kohler says she's feeling fine after getting her third shot on Monday. It's just a sore arm. That That's all it is. Did it bother you at all to get another shot? It, shots don't bother me. After being in the Air Force for 12 years, they don't bother me. So getting it, uh, I'm relieved now. Why were you relieved? I don't know. I just want to be able to get out and enjoy uh, the area again. Another drop in the signal while talking about an extra shot in the arm. But the interruptions didn't keep Kohler from her direct message. If it keeps you safe, then please, by all means, get it, please. Right. That's Hope Ford reporting for us tonight. So if another shot is recommended for everyone, the plan is to have people who have received their second dose of Pfizer or Moderna to get a booster eight months later. The Johnson & Johnson vaccine has not been approved for any additional shots.